Yeah, hello. Yes, this is an emergency. There's someone in my apartment. My name, my name is Jordan Vogel. Vogel? V-O-G-E-L. It's uh, 1865 uh, West 27th. It's apartment 325. No, I haven't seen the person. No, I haven't seen him. No, I haven't seen the person. No. I don't know. All I know is this white box in my house and it keeps following me around. I, I, I went outside and I, I threw the garbage. I threw the box in the garbage. No, it, it, it just follows me back into the apartment. American POW Mary Jones was found in an abandoned Iraqi camp near Baghdad. Other soldiers were found dead in what seemed to be torture chambers. The names of these soldiers will only be released to the families who are now suffering with the reality of war. In other news, the takeover of Baghdad has proven to be more difficult than anticipated. In the past 48 hours, massive riots have broken out, accounting for the deaths of over 2,500 civilians, most of them innocent women and children. Our field reporter, Michael Kent, is there with more on the story. Thank you, Christy. I am standing just a few blocks outside of downtown Baghdad, where the intensity of the riots has actually increased over the last few hours. Uh, civilians have taken to the streets, mostly armed with guns and knives, to break into the local and government buildings. Uh, you can see here where people are carrying stolen televisions and chairs, and even food. Iraqi soldiers have opened fire on the masses, mainly targeting while Iraqi soldiers and Iraqi uh, news as well have been blaming American and British forces for the thousands of civilian casualties. Back to you. One more person. One more. Insignificant. Good morning, Mr. Vogel. How was your night? I take it you didn't get much sleep. Anyway, you know why I'm here. May I? I am so glad, as are my constituents, that you decided to push the button. I have to add, not too many people turned down the offer. You, on the other hand, you had expressed some apprehension. You don't see that too often these days. It is a nice change. Yeah, I don't feel too good about any of this. How, how can I be sure that this is all, you know, legal? You don't have to worry, Mr. Vogel. You're fine. Our company doesn't have to deal with any of those legal issues. Anyway, shall we? As you know, because of your decision, someone you have never met, someone you will never meet, on the other side of the world has died, but that is of no importance to you. In keeping with our agreement, I'd like to present to you, Mr. Vogel, $70,000. Just kidding. It's all yours. Thank you. 
Thank you. Thank you so much. These are the great moments of my job. It has been a pleasure doing business with you. Now, if you'll excuse me. I have another business meeting to attend. I will be heading to a place far away from here, on the other side of the world. A business trip much like this one. I will be giving this box to someone else, someone who you have never met, and who has never met you, whose existence you will never be aware of, and who will never be aware of your existence, if that person decides to push this button. 